Drum, Philly film. Drum, games. Drum. It's over. Welcome to Philly film psychic killing shit. Damn. Yeah, that sounds about right. Isn't that what we do? Yeah. Eric wants to experiment to see how sick and uh, perverted he is when it comes to murder. So he wants to play um, Mad World, which is what we're he's playing. I'm just sitting back and enjoying to see how creative he is in killing a man. It's terrible! Good thing I'm on this side. Yes, they're demanding that we not approach the city, and we've been told anyone who does will be met with force. But look, we have huge, huge dildos to beat them over the head with. Kaboom! Uh, all like three civilians apparently. Yep. I ate a lot of shit before I came out here, and I'm really plugged up. So is he supposed to be like a fat Bill Clinton? I don't know. He sounds like it. Uh, does anybody have a cigar? <laughs> oh, hell. But yeah, this game is all about how creative you can kill somebody. You actually get more points. It's like a mix between the movie Running Man and... Uh... Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah. Uh... What the hell was that movie? Uh, something in New York. Uh, what was the shit with Kurt Russell? With the patch over his eye. Oh. Um. Crap. Yeah, I can't remember the name of it. So yeah, this is all about how it's it's yeah it's like a mix between Running Man and all sorts of thud. shit. Yep, thud. And it's all gonna be monochrome like this. So if you're expecting a whole lot of cl color, other than maybe red. You're not going to get it. Damn, I wish I had a chest that hairy. <laughs> oh, the hell you are. I got Lyme disease. Ready as always. Tell, tell Jet I'm going to be late. I got to go get Ed. And the dog. I can't remember the dog's name. Ein. That's right. Short for Einstein, I think, right? No, Did you ever watch Cowboy Bebop? A little bit. Okay. Okay, so what am I doing here? Uh, you go to the map because you gotta rank up in order to uh, progress. So. I see. Yeah. Basically, just go in, kick ass, and go to the next stage. Cool. Yeah, and that's the boss. Oh, he's pretty. Little Eddie. Yeah, he is a pretty man. I was in Playgirl 1992, and then I had an accident with a cell phone in a microwave. <laughs> As you can see, I got prettier. <laughs> it really paid off. <laughs> it's like that episode of South Park where Stan's dad put his net sack in a microwave <laughs> so they get legal marijuana in Colorado. You're a very pussified version of Jason. Anyone else here feel they deserve a sponsor? Well, apparently nobody else wants to join AA. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Forget it. I could use a sponsor. Who's there? Show yourself. Cigarette will. Yes. Uh, hi. There is a signing bonus, right? Of course. But I wouldn't spend your bonus just yet. He's already killed two thousand bigger than yourself. Ooh, Matrix stuff. Oh. <laughs> Cheap shot. <laughs> yeah, really. Which means he's killed 2,000 dumber than he is. Bigger don't mean better. That's the guy who plays the Wolverine on the newer X-Men cartoons. Yeah, it's the same guy. Yeah. I can't remember his name right now to save my life. Please, in the comments, tell me who the dude is. Because I've seen him on I Know That Voice, but I don't know who he is. I'll supply you with such weaponry as you require. Sounds like we got a deal. 
You can call me 13, as I represent... Sponsors. Which tells you how many hairs I have left on my head. Yup. For contract purposes, of course. Jack. Big Dick Johnson. Yes, <laughs> oh, oh, that reminds me. Because this was a big thing when I was little. <laughs> Did you ever hear of the shirts called Big Johnson? Okay. This was a big thing. I owned a few of them. My father never really cared. But there was this sh line of shirts called Big Johnson. And they would have just stupid products on the back. And it was the most misogynistic stuff you could imagine. But I'm 13. I'm just like, ha ha ha, dick jokes. Mm -hmm. um, like the one I remember most was the shirt that I had called Big Johnson Jackhammers. Mm -hmm. And it's this little, like, the Johnson character was like this little nerdy guy with like little red glasses. And he always had this bigger, better version of whatever the object was. Mm -hmm. So, like, the Jackhammer's tagline was, Drill in the spot till it gets hot. <laughs> or, um, the other one, I didn't own this one. I knew another guy in high school who did. It was uh, Big Johnson Casino. Liquor up front, <laughs> poker in the back. It's like, oh my god, is that, um... Oh, what's the name of that comedian? Um, fuck, I know the name of that comedian. Shit. Oh, no, it sounds like him. But yeah, this is all about... Yeah, oh, this is the basic stuff. Okay, this is your tutorial. Nice. <laughs> yeah, if you do all this shit, things will happen. Yeah, so like I said, kiddies, it's 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 monochrome except for the blood. So it's like the worst version of uh, Schindler, Schindler's List you'll ever see. Oh my god, I can't believe I went there. Ah, fuck it. Oh yeah, your chainsaw for quick and easy kills. Oh yeah, and the chainsaw's gonna keep going. You might want to tone that down on the on the mic on the microphone. After you take care of this shit. Yeah. Oh, look, another shithead. Jesus, okay, someone ate their Wheaties this morning. <laughs> yeah, so Jump can... over this pile of scrap. Yes, can you do it? Why don't you, I was going to say, why don't you lower the volume down a little bit if you can. Yeah, because that, yeah, that, uh, oh, I guess not. Alright. Because you shouldn't be able to, yeah, I think you can. There, yeah, there you go. Yeah, because we'll just shut the fuck up. That's the last thing. Minimum of talking. And... So I was in... So yeah, I was on a hot date last night. Yeah, that would be great commentary. Look at these fox. I bet you can take them out. Oh yeah, there's some shit that you can use to actually... You can use the environment in a lot of... Sp yeah, there's a lot of... I don't remember having this yellow tinge to it. That was more black and white, but whatever. I don't care. But yeah, see, when they get, uh, when they get, like, groggy, you can take them to places to kill them. Mm. So you can actually move them around and shit. And it gives you more bonuses and stuff. So now that he's stunned, you can... So yeah, you can just do the classic. Actually, no, that might be the dude who voices Bender. Which would make sense. <laughs> yeah. The, the commentary is like bad radio stuff. So... Yeah. So far, Eric's not the most creative killer, but it's working towards it. But yeah, you can, like, you'll see things, like, hanging off the wall, or, like, barrels, and you just, you Like, when they're stunned, you can just grab them and take them to it, and, like... 
Put him out of their misery. Then you can just sit there and do this. Right? Or, yeah. Uh, I was going to say, I think if you spin for a certain amount, you can actually direct your throws and whatnot, but I don't know how. I think they want you to actually kill a certain way first. Yeah. Perfect target. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, this. Yeah. Poop will fight. Head bottom. Yep. Oh, yeah, now they're going to show you how to use the, uh, the items in the stage to make your kills more creative. You gotta carry it. Oh, okay. And then you can throw it. Yeah. So, are you done playing with tires? Yeah. So now you've got him stuck, and now you've just kicked his ass. <laughs> I laugh while I look at you. Oh, God, the sign. This is fucked up. This is one of the most fucked up ways to kill a human being in this game. So, anyway, you got it. Okay, well, you had it. And after you flung him. Uh, I keep dropping it. I'm not used to having a hold button. So, yeah, when you... Yeah, that. Yeah, because, you know, that's, um... That's right through the face. Yeah. Oh, and then this part. Because you can combine all this shit. Uh -huh. So then you can take your, your your dude who's now got a sign through his face. Um, yeah, you can get rid of him first. Uh, go away. Grab your, grab your, oh no. He's dead. Okay. So, oh you're, well. I grabbed the guy who's already stunned. I gotta grab this dude. No, you can grab a stun dude. And if he starts to resist, no, it's it's to your left. Okay, I'll just take it for a long walk. Oh, if he, yeah, there yeah. you go. Take that. And then you just walk over here, like, and meanwhile, Larry's like, "Oh, hey, Joe, how you? Do oh, Joe, what the fuck's going on?" So that's one of the ways you can do it. You can actually constantly slam him in the, repeatedly if you want. It's it's really fucked up. Yeah, of course. But like I say, you can combine all this shit. You can, you can first of all put him in with a you know put a tire over their head, then put a sign through their face, then finish them off with the, <laughs> with the spikes, because, fuck, why yeah, not? Exactly. Yeah. So it's all based on creativity, like, how creative are you with killing? So, do, do what I just suggested. Hit him with the sign, hit him with the tar, the tar, so. Yeah, run him through with the sign. Yep. Okay. Uh, welcome to Philly Film Mass Murder. Dead. Just about. Yes. I really like these good. Oh, I was preferring to use the stop sign, not a fucking pedestrian sign. So yeah, you can do it one of two ways. You can either throw them in right now, or you can get real close and then just this, this, this. that, and then it's yeah. Yep. And you get more points. More points. Points. Here's a little something. A box! Oh, oh, God, a box. I get a box! I hope it's full of Fruit Loops! I love Fruit Loops. Do that. Uh, that is... Oh, I think that's an extra guy. I was you to continue the game. Oh, okay. So next time on Philly Film Games, now the tutorial's over, we're gonna go kick some ass! Yep.